And back to that breaking news we told you about at the start of the newscast, a SWAT situation in East El Paso. It's happening on Dempsey Avenue near Burgess High School, and that's where we find KTSM 9 News reporter Tatiana Favela live. That's right, we've been sticking out here for you guys, and again, this is the closest that we can get. We're here off of WH Burgess Drive in East El Paso. You can take a look behind me. There's still some police activity that's out here in the area, just one block away from the home where a man barricaded himself on Dempsey Avenue. Now, this is a video our cameras got right when we showed up to the scene. Police responded to a family violence call around 7.30 this evening, saying the man was armed with a gun and then barricaded himself inside the home. Some units who were responded to the area earlier have already left, but there's still an active presence blocking off the area for other drivers. Police tell us there are no injuries. However, they are still working on getting him out. Crisis management team officers are trying to convince him to step out of the house and surrender himself. Uh, the SWAT team is also at the location and uh, they're standing by. So. And this area, again, is closed off starting at WH Burgess Drive. Police tell us that this area will be closed off for several hours. We'll continue to keep you updated on air and online as soon as we learn more information. For now, live in East El Paso, Tatiana Favela, KTSM 9 News.